Master Firefly. I'm gonna pull up the set between these two. I'm not, I think this starts top eight. I think this I think is this top eight. Yeah, this, this starts is top, top eight. eight. It's all best of five, correct? All right, best of five. Yep. Moving forward, we have Firefly versus Aster. Local, I'm, dang, I keep doing that. Local Regional of, of Louisiana, number 24. The monthly Lafayette's premiere. Both players incredibly experienced in the matchup. Uh, Aster being a local of Lafayette, Wink, um, very distance <laughs> to play against Kyle, the best Rob in the state all the darn time. Um, and then also you have Firefly able to play against Zai, the best Palutena in the state all the damn time. Mm -hmm. So this should be interesting. Either, obviously, both of the aforementioned players of the respective characters these two players play against play the game vastly differently. So you're gonna have a little bit more mix in the interactions. You know, Aster more of a straight Palutena, the juxtaposing Zion, and then Kyle being a far lamer Rob player. Nice dash attack. Oh, and we got the tricks on our sleeves right now. That's still a silly two piece with the gyro in hand. Mm -hmm. Pull up the set record real quick between these two. See Firefly convincingly is holding down this lead right now, not letting Aster get any opening, not letting him take too much damage. We only have 82, no, I'm sorry, 93 on this first stock. We were able to take the first stock rather convincingly, yep. almost a zero to death, not mm -hmm. quite, only 6%, but still Aster having a very, very <sighs> long uphill battle ahead of him right now. Yeah, Aster 0-2 against Firefly so far, both losses being 0-2. Um, I'm hoping, you know, we can have a little bit of progress in the, the struggle with this ma player matchup here for Aster. Maybe take game three, make things more interesting for the viewers at home, too. Now, it was uh, Rob Palatina both, time, oh, both times. Always. Okay. Two diehard of the character yeah, players. I, I know these are both uh, character specialists for these characters, but sometimes in bracket, you know, you, you just never know. They oh, won't no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Secondary Firefly, or two. Firefly, like, obviously, no. Great read um, for pulling out the secondaries at the rogue brackets. Thankfully, showing a little respect to Aster here. Staying Rob. I appreciate it. Oh, had the read on the roll-in, but wasn't quite in time there for it. All right, up throw, forward air. Nair gonna miss. We're gonna back up, do a little bit of lasers. Ooh, God bless you. Ooh, thank you. It's still coming. Woo! Right. Okay, we're, we're back, chat. We're Sorry. living. <laughs> God, I took my allergy meds too today. No respite. They get on it, man. Yeah, Aster's stuck in this corner, getting boxed out by every other option in the book. No tech there on the ledge, not quite needing it. Good job he didn't tech there, though. Probably would have died to the back air. Nice spot dodge, gonna avoid the dash attack. Man, this relentless pressure coming from Firefart, clearly a very capable boxer on the character. Nice little ledge slip. The uppy. Oh, nice little dance there with the uppy by the ledge. Gonna punch that such from S smash. Really well played by Firefly. Super relentless pressure in that last stock. He, it's like he didn't even. It's like Firefly was playing from behind in that last one interaction. At least he had the you know, blood in the water kind of smell. Like, yeah, Aster screwed you. He's got to do something silly to get out of the corner. Cool stuff. Really cool gameplay there by Firefly. Oh, uh, yeah. I like the, the A land up smash idea. That's kind of cool. It's cute. It's silly, but you know. A little too early in that regard. Ooh, yeah. Chat, I brought a Pop Tart, and I just remembered that I brought myself a Pop Tart, and I, I'm i so happy right now. Uh, cinnamon Brown Sugar. Mm. I am yeah, you a lost me. Cinnamon Brown Sugar. I, what? Oh I'm a S'mores gosh. enjoyer, personally. It's good. That's my number two. S'mores? That's my number two. I love it, and the strawberry's number three. I'm uh, a very basic, by the books kind of Pop Tart guy. Cookies and Cream, number two, and then really? Pop Fudge Sunday, number Pop three. Pop Fudge Sunday's good. It's good. I know there's not a lot of bad picks. Um, what's going on? I think Aster's grabbing something. I'm gonna give them a second. I can't tell if Firefly's looking down. Yeah, he was. Okay, we're chilling. Yeah, oh, okay, we're moving okay, okay, the yeah, I respect that. Let me get rid of this laser because it fully charged. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, we're just gonna gentlemen right back into this. All right. Good stuff here. Clear not playing for timeout. It's either players. No! Oh my god. Yeah. So are we establishing this as a button chat? Uh, or are we just moving right into it. We're just gonna hold. <laughs> we, we have to hold it. We have to hold it. I love to see the the Rob combos come out though. I think not doing them at this point in the meta is like kind of a sin, you know? Why are you not pushing the easiest, coolest character in the game, debatably, to his absolute limits? Sing. Aster holding it down off stage right now, real quick. Oh, we got a reversal coming in from Firefly. Yeah. They're a great option for doing set reversals too. I'm really glad more of these raw players are using it. That and then just down tilting after A landing is also a fantastic option. I've been seeing these players do. S Smash almost getting the read, okay. Would've been an angry comeback idea. 
Oh, finding the bear on the start of the teleport. Six stuff there by Firefly. Oh, not getting the shield poke in that there. I love the setup idea, though, for Firefly. That was sick. No out of shield gyro punish either from Master. Taking himself for that one. I know he's been live in them very recently. Oh, not even gonna be able to find the landing arrow behind that up air. Yep. Right near there. It's looking real rough right now for Aster. No much help. Hold down the ledge trap. We're back. Curse, you have a trade there from Aster. Clearing the corner for himself. Nice back here. Not gonna take the stock. Rob, gigantic. Incapable of dying at such early, modest percents. Incapable. Incapable. <laughs> <laughs> the lovely choice of words. <laughs> yep. Nice delay jump. Nice yeah. back air. Yeah. Backwards aerial. Clearly some work to do there in the matchup for the fair matchup for Master. Right. The fortunate stuff. I think he beat Kyle already in this bracket too. So warmed up against the character, but not the player, it's, it seems. Yeah, I think that was a grab coming out of that landing fair. Bit of a white flag there by Aster in the gameplay. Homework? This is our new social media person. Cool. Yeah, shout outs to Scoots. Scoots Magoots, our new social media person. That's me. We'll start That's posting me. clips on our social media pages in order for us to start getting more views and chat. So. Coming into game three. Hopefully, we've got the download on Astro's part. I'm eager to see what he brings to the table or if we're going to continue waving the white flag at the very end of that last game. Patient start for the neutral for both characters. No one really rushing to take center. I don't think either character super cares about it. Rather than, I know Paolo likes having other characters fight out of the corner more times than not. And I don't think Rob, the camping machine that he can be, minds it either. Nice nair. Netting a little 33% combo. Gets the jump read, not quite in position for it though. Dare on shield, gonna net a little down tilt punch from Firefly. Great recognition that you can do a dare or a down tilt out of shield. Side B catching the up B. No jump, I believe. Oh, mistiming the back air. Not quite there for it. Good read there on the up B from Aster, or er, Firefly. Nice punish there from Aster on the jump behind with the grab. Six stuff. I love the, the game that we got Aster playing right now. Ooh, yeah. A little too angsty to go high. Good recognition to get the up smash here from the pushback. After the pushback of the to get up attack. Oh, not quite getting the combo. Might find it anyways. No jump read. I like the option select there. Good stuff. You know, seeing you can throw the gyro into that nair when it's about finished on the high nair. Yeah, the gyro at disadvantage coming in clutch right here for Firefly. Doubling back on the fair to box out there. Keeping Kyle in the corner. I love the option. No air dodge. Yeah, nice stuff. Guess you can see the fence there in advantage state. Yeah, it's too far to really recover that up with no jump. <laughs> Third time, right? Had to work. Puts a lot of shield. Platform. Saving acid from the silly combo that was up Firefly Sleeve. I like to run up near there and try to punish the Nair from Firefly. It was cool. Nope. Oh. I like the idea of looking for that dare too by Firefly's part. Getting the grab in the run up chicken game. Not quite going to get the boxing option with the fair. And down tilt from the nair. Day one. We're back, baby. Oh my god. Catching the little ledge shark there. Well versed gameplay from Firefly. Cool stuff, man. 